let's can let's can let's keep this fire burning. Let's keep learning. Mm. Let's keep making sure that we got the narrative that our frequency requires. Come on. Right. Huh? The highest frequency. This yeah. frequency is the frequency of a living soul. Mm. God breathed the breath of life into man. He became a living, living soul. soul. That's the frequency we own. Come on. Huh? Even enduring the persecution by way of truth and patience, wherein they shall be those that shall be appointed keepers of the source of all prophecies that shall come to pass in the latter day. Whereby they shall guide humanity in such a manner that encourages all who seek true faith stay to stay path. on what? On the path. On the path of, of what? True faith. So we got to stay on a path. Mm. Tariq. Tariq. Hmm? When the Messiah was saying, I am the way. Mm -hmm. I am the truth. I am the life. He wasn't saying, me, I am. Mm. He was saying, mm. I am I it. Need. See, because pe people miss... Unfortunately, they, they hold on to the misinterpretation. Yeah. On the radio recently, and they said, like, yeah, but Jesus said, I am the way. No, he was saying, I am is the way. How do we know that? Because he said, I and the Father are one. So it ain't about Jesus. It ain't about Yahshua. He never said, just believe me. Hold on to me. He, that was not the message he was given. He was saying you had to go back to Exodus 3, 14 and 15, where I am is the name that we're supposed to be using forever. Come on. Right. And Come originally on. that was Ane. You would say Aini in the Hebrew. Anea. In the Sumerian, you would say Anea. Mm -hmm. In the Tamaric, you would say Ane. Aneire. Mm -hmm. We got to go back to that original word. Come on. The Messiah is definitely a part of the plan. Yes, we love and respect the Messiah, Yahshua Christ. But that so same Messiah, he said, you got to do even greater works than I did. John 14, 12. How you going to do greater works and you ain't did the work yet? <laughs> you so busy being in awe that you 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 can't even stand up and do the work. Come on. But you going to do greater works? How? <laughs> it it can't happen. Because they made this man so perfect that you mm. can't relate to him. My goodness. Mm. And he was a virgin. Really? Mm -hmm. Died at 33. He never saw. He ain't never been having it. Uh-oh. Yeah. <laughs> I ain't been to go over some of y'all heads, but I'm going to tell you right now. If he died a virgin, he ain't been he ain't to heaven. He ain't been to heaven. He came out of it, but he never went back in. Yeah, one of them Roman, <laughs> one of them Roman boys. We Africans, we African men. We love some heaven. Yes, Huh? You come out of the garden as a baby, and you spend the rest of your life trying to get back in that garden. Huh? We are teaching church. We read a read. See. If you make this Messiah so perfect that you can't relate Lame. to the Messiah, mm. how can you do the works of the Messiah mm -hmm. in order to do greater than the Messiah? It can't happen. Come on. No? I didn't say this. John 14, 12. Let's just make like sure it. people know. I'm not, I'm not trying to be funny. I'm not trying to be disrespectful. Mm. Come on, come I'm on. teaching you the scriptures. Teaching that we supposed to know. We don't want to talk about this. John 14 and 12. Mm. Verily, verily, uh, amen, amen. That's what verily means. Huh? I say unto you, he that believeth on me, not in me, on me, you believe that what I'm doing works, so you're going to do it too. Ooh, that's right. Huh? Who believeth on me? The works that I do that's shall right. he do also. Isn't that what he just said? Who, who believes so? On believing on the Messiah means you're gonna do the works that the but Messiah I've did. Done. Also, mm. that's what it means to believe on the Messiah. Teach it. Not say, "Oh, I believe in Jesus." <laughs> you don't do nothing Jesus did. <laughs> you waiting for Easter right now? Uh oh. Did the Messiah celebrate Easter? Well, why would he? They say it was because he died. Crucified. <laughs> <laughs> that don't make no sense. Mm, let's go ahead and make a good meal so I can when I get crucified. The last supper. No, he was celebrating Passover. 
Do you celebrate Passover, good Christians? You love Jesus so much. You love Jesus so much, but Jesus wasn't even a good Christian. Uh oh. Never said he was a Christian, never told you to be a Christian. Mm. Right. Matter of fact, he told you to be wary of people calling themselves Christians. Uh -oh. Go to Matthew 24. Teach it, Cajon. Verily, verily, I say unto you, John 14, 12, He that believeth on me, the works that I do, shall he do also, and greater works than these shall he do, because I go unto my Father. Mm. You have to do the work. You waiting for Jesus to come back and do the work. Uh-oh. Mm. Uh-oh. Huh? That's the problem we got. Coming to save you. Huh? Nobody who ain't already here. Come Matthew 24, verse 5. What does it say? The Messiah is warning his disciples. This 24th chapter is in alignment with the 24th hour. This moment in time that we're in right now. But we better recognize who is here with us. Among. The man, Gabriel, is here with us. According to the book of Daniel, chapter 9, verse 21. Matthew 24, verse 5, for many shall come in my name. Uh -oh. Isn't that what they do? Yep. Don't they come in the name of Christ? Mm -hmm. Don't they come in the name of Jesus? Mm -hmm. For many shall come in my name, saying, I am Christ. Now let's pay attention to how he's saying it now. He's speaking to his disciples. He said, a lot of people will come saying, I'm Christ. Not me, not Uncle. This is, this is the Messiah, Yahshua Koresh, speaking to his disciples. And this, he's, this is what he's warning them. In this, this is how you know you're in the last days. In this hour. Many people are going to come saying, I am Christ. Huh? Yeah. And shall deceive many. Uh -oh. Not me saying it. How do you know he was, his name was, wasn't Christ? Go to John 141. Mm. Who, who, and who was doing this? John 141. He first findeth his own brother Simon and saith unto him, we have found the Messiah, which is being interpreted to Christ. So many shall come in my name, saying, I am Christ. He was not Christ. The Christ they talking about is Krishna. An interpretation. An interpretation by the Greeks. The Greeks have hijacked the scripture. That's their frequency. Their frequency don't work with us. That's why you call it on Christ. And murder is happening. Uh oh. Now you call it on Christ, the economy gets worse. Uh oh. You call it on Christ, the gas price went up. Uh oh. You call uh -oh. it on Christ, fill in the blank. Come on, teach it. Come All on. of the chaos we have is called a crisis. Uh oh. Mm. You call it on Christ or a crisis? Mm. Come on. Feel like we calling on a crisis because the crisis is is here every day. Come on, it's perpetual. You, but perpetual. you won't say Yahshua. You won't, you won't even try to form your mouth to say Yahshua mm. to learn about this breath of life. He said the Messiah blew on his disciples in the book of John 20 right. and 22. John 20 and 22. He blew. Why, why would he have to blow on his disciples? Mm. Because what does fire mean? Fire needs oxygen. Fire needs wind. You got to keep this fire burning by having the breath of life. Come on. John 20 and 22. And when he had said this, he breathed on them and said unto them, Receive ye the Holy, Holy Ghost. Ghost. So, so did they wait till Pentecost to have the Holy no. Ghost? And we know the word ghost ain't there. The Holy Soul, the spirit of truth. That's talking. That's spoken in, in the book of John chapter 16. This spirit of truth was already on the Messiah. I mean, and his disciples... Before the Pentecost. Peach, that's right. Mm -hmm. Oh, no, but you know, when the Pentecost came and the, the Holy Ghost came in like a Russian wind. Uh, he didn't come in like a Russian wind when he was talking to Mary. Uh oh, uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> he, he didn't he took his time that day. <laughs> <laughs> that was hardly fit. 